just want to ask some questions here, and I hope you guys ask questions too and look into some stuff. But things I've been thinking about, and I, I've, I've thought about them in the past, but especially nowadays with what's been going on, is let's think about the Amish. The Amish people. Now, the Amish people don't vaccinate their children. The Amish, um, Amish people don't get vac vaccines. The Amish people are self-sufficient. So the Amish people um, drink raw milk. And just raw milk itself has been deemed illegal in a bunch of places because it's dangerous. It's not homogenized, which means it hasn't been boiled to boil everything out of there, including the nutrition. That's what has to be fortified with stuff. But anyways, the Amish are fine. The Amish don't have um, a lot of death. There is, there's not, you know, Amish people, groups of Amish people aren't being wiped out due to sickness, due to anything. I mean, if you want to call them vaccines or due to bacterial deals or due to other stuff, the Amish are fine. So, let's, we talked about raw milk just briefly, just look into that. Why is it illegal for you and I to get and for the most part, why is it illegal for the Amish to sell for the most part? But why are the Amish fine? Something to ponder. And now back on the vaccines, if you want to call them vaccines, call them vaccines. Amish people don't vaccinate their children. Amish people don't get vaccinated. So why aren't hundreds or thousands or hundreds of thousands of Amish wiped out by smallpox, polio, chickenpox, uh, the flu, hepatitis A or hepatitis B, um, uh, HPV, don't have issues with that, measles, diphtheria, uh, tetanus, I haven't heard any horror stories of Amish people getting tetanus, especially with the machinery use, they use. Um, and then mumps, and there's many others that the children here need to have their vaccines up to date in order to go to school. Um, for the most part, especially in California and other states like that don't, who don't allow exemptions. And I didn't hear, I haven't heard of any Amish with this new, this new uh, CB19 thing uh, that started, well, started, they want to tell us it started late 2018, I mean, late 2019, early 2020. But I haven't heard anything there. There hasn't been any clearance, any people wiped out, uh, even tens, hundreds, thousands, tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. The Amish are fine. It's just something to think about. And look into it, research it. Just ask why. Why, if it's they're so detrimental and it's something to worry about and it's so bad if people don't get vaccinated um, or if your children don't get vaccinated or if they're not up to date on all their vaccines, it's, it's so bad. How are the Amish? Fine. How have they been fine? Something to think about. And then hopefully look into research. This was just a, a small little quick video. I just had these questions. I just wanted to put it out here. Maybe get people back in. But uh, thank you for watching. Stay vigilant. Protect yourself. Protect your family. Protect your health. And protect your wealth.